Okay. Okay, so before we start, everybody graduating needs to grab a shell and a red piece of glass. This is going to involve sharing. I'm used to bothering. Light is so bright. But you did good at school. I'm so excited that our things are blue and not red like other children. Can we kill that shit? Well, I mean, it was bad, but I kind of don't. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That might not be the best angle. No, no, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I might move. I might be moving around. Okay. We live such a complex, interesting life. <laughs> okay, so everybody graduated, you should grab a shell of your choice and a piece of red glass. Oh, you're good. Thank you. There she is. <laughs> Okay, so between the songs, I just want to say congratulations to everybody graduating, first of all. Yeah. You guys should give yourselves a hand. That was really lame. Clap loudly. Yeah, show, show. So many of you guys are leaving us, which is very sad. But that's what we do. We, we train you guys and we send you off in the big, bad, crazy world, right? My one ask of you guys is to be bold. A lot of you guys have had, have had conversations with us over the last year about all the challenges and the craziness and the insanity that seems to be going on. And a lot of you have been very sad. And a lot of you have been very, very depressed and anxious and everything. Screw that. Screw that! Yeah, that's right, screw that. Right, there you go. Nobody ever had it easy, right? We don't come from the stock that has a bunch of uh, you know trust funds and all these wonderful opportunities. We've had to work, you guys have had to work for where you've gotten to. Yeah? So this craziness that seems to be going on in the world and our planet, who cares, right? You guys are going to rise up to that. So we've given you guys skills. So you guys have shells right now in your hand. Yeah? Yeah. So that's your education. That's the stuff that Dr. Rodriguez gave you, Dr. Wu gave you, Dr. Ohira gave you, Dr. Patch gave you. Thank you. Everybody. Dr. Reinemann, Emily, everybody, right? But that's But that's only half of it. The other thing you have in your hand is a piece of unformed glass. Yeah? yeah. Who the hell knows what that's going to become? You guys will figure out what that's going to become. At this season right now, there's all these, you know, Steve Jobs and all these wonderful, inspiring people, and they tell you all these things. It's true. <laughs> but they tell you all these things about just be great and live your dream and all that kind of stuff, right? And you should try to do that. But the reality is there's some amount of luck involved in all this, these future pursuits that you guys are gonna do. Some amount of serendipity, and we can't affect that. What we've tried to do over these last four, or five, or six years, or nine, or nine is, to, is to try to reduce the effect of that chance, to try to reduce the effect of that serendipity, right? By giving you guys skills, train, making you knowledgeable about all these things, and arming you guys so that you can go solve these problems that we're worried about. Problems of the environment, problems of social inequality, all these things, right? 
We need you. Dr. Rodriguez needs you. My son needs you to solve these challenges. And the only way to do that is to be bold. Is to be bold, right? Do not cower. Do not hang out. Do not drink yourself into oblivion or smoke yourself out. Be bold. Be bold. Is everybody going to jump from the ship heroically and grab the grab the ladder and go away on the helicopter like the magical Hollywood ending? No, it won't always work out. But you need to jump. You need to try things that aren't necessarily normal. You guys need to do what you think and you know is right. That could be a job, that could be a decision in a job, that could be a bunch of a million different things. But we need you guys to be bold. We've given you tools to be bold, but ultimately it comes down to you guys deciding to do that. And and there's no, there's no magic thing here, there's no special thing, but it's trying to be true to what we've taught you and trying to be too, true to your internal values. So that red stuff is unformed glass. That red stuff is your future. That red stuff is where you guys are gonna go be bold. We'll go different places, we'll do different things, but I hope you guys stay in touch. We want to hear about all this awesomeness you guys create. We want to be, we want to hear about all this cool stuff that you guys invent and you try. And it's totally chill if you fail. It's not chill if you fail and you give up. It's not chill if you don't get that job you're looking for and then just bail on it, right? It takes, it takes a million tries sometimes to get it right. And our planet and our people need you guys to try as hard as you can all the time. So we talk about the ESRM family, right? And you guys are all part of our ESRM family. But just because you're going away doesn't mean that you're you're divorced from us somehow. <laughs> or that dad went this way and mom went that way. Or that dad went to Colorado and mom stayed in California. It's not like that. It's not like that, right? So we want to stay in touch with you guys. Please let us know. Please. I wasn't trying to point a finger, I'm just saying. But stay in touch and be bold. One of the best pieces of information I ever got before I started grad school, when I was diving on the ice in Antarctica and I, and I came up and I was talking to my, my, uh, the head researcher guy, he said, what are you doing when you get back to the world? And I said, oh, I'm going to go to grad school. And he goes, ah, oh, what are you going to do? I'm going to go to grad school at UCLA. What are you going to do? Oh, I'm going to study intertidal, da, 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 da. And he said, ah, oh, Jesus Christ. He said, can you please do something original? Can you please not do the same thing that those 14 other people that had your background, whatever, did? Not because those 14 people were doing something bad, but because they weren't being imaginative. And he wanted me to go do something different. And so that's my request for you guys. Tomorrow we're going to go walk down. You guys are going to get your family going to be there. We're going to clap. We're going to hug. All that good Saturday. stuff. Saturday. <laughs> Saturday, you're going to go down. You're going to clap. You're going to hug. All that good stuff. But Sunday, right? Sunday is the rest. Or some of you that need to finish up in the summer, the day after that, or in the fall, whatever. Whatever that day is, you're going to look at that and you need to be bold. So my last ask is that not only do you guys be bold and not only do you stay in touch with us, but you really be true to yourself. And, and you're the only one that can do that. Don't lose faith. It might get hard at times when you're not getting that offer when the pay is super low. Stay true to your beliefs. We believe in you guys. If you guys ever need to... <laughs> Hallelujah, sister! Testify! <laughs> we're here for an incredibly short amount of time. If we're lucky, we have a few more decades. And then it's passed on to someone else. Make a difference with that time. Doesn't matter who's president. Doesn't matter who's your boss. You guys decide your fate. You guys are in charge of the choices that you make. So with that, I'm gonna say, everybody raise a glass. Yeah. Yeah. Congratulations to the class of 2018!
All right, cool. Take Back to drinking. <laughs> 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 <laughs>